Earlier this year, a very close friend and partner in ministry passed away suddenly. And I struggled very, very greatly with grieving her death in the beginning because of the difficult circumstances around it. And although I knew that my friend was definitely with God, there was a very, very deep pain in my heart from the loss that I, I just couldn't articulate. Actually, I struggled even to cry. I lost sleep for a few weeks and I had frequent nightmares. I knew that I had to find a way to process my grief and every day the question that I asked God was, God, please let me cry. Why can't I cry? And then during a grief counselling session, the dam finally broke and I experienced a breakthrough in my emotions. I didn't really know how the tears finally found their way to the surface, but I'm really glad they did. The therapist and my fellow session mates also created a safe space for me. And so it was at that moment that I experienced God's deep comfort and peace. And then I was reminded that God really comforts us in all our troubles and that we can comfort others as well. Eventually, the nightmare stopped and I began to have better sleep. And I began to also feel a greater sense of calm and peace. And while I know all that therapy was really helpful, but you know that peace was not manufactured by the therapy or human effort. The peace was supernatural. And of course, many times in that period of time when I was grieving the loss, I asked, is God here? Where is God in this situation? And if God, you are really hearing me, then what are you going to do to help me? And amazingly, God always comes through. And this is something that I experience deeply, His love, His comfort, His peace. And even in the death and the grief and the loss that I was going through, I knew that God knew every single emotion in my heart. And the tears that couldn't come forth eventually, by His grace, He allowed me to grieve. And God's presence was really very real. And I know that this is definitely something which I will always hold close to my heart, that God is a God of comfort.